It's a heavyweight showdown between John Jones and Israel Adesanya. All right, so here he is, the inimitable last style bender, Israel Adesanya, still undefeated as a mixed martial artist. DC, you tried to bring him in to emulate John Jones back in the day, and he's such a meticulous, thoughtful guy that he said no because Luke Rocco was in that gym and he thought he might have to fight him one. He knew that at some point he would reach Luke Rocco in his division, so he said, you know what? I want to help you, DC, but I can't because of what's going to happen going forward in my career. He did not want to push Luke or himself in such an awkward situation. How about forward thinking? How about forward thinking that that would have come to pass only a few short years later? But in Israel Adesanya, you also have the mentality, but the fighting ability to become a UFC champion in only 12, 13 months. All right, so here he is, UFC light heavyweight champion times two. Future Hall of Famer, a man you know as well as anyone, DC, Johnny Bones Jones. John Jones is one of those talents that when you see him for the first time, you understand that he is something special. He has a very strong mind, unbelievable skill set, and an ability to rise to the occasion. He did it from the moment he first stepped foot in the octagon as a very young fighter to his long championship reign. Some of the victims on John Jones' resume is unbelievable to have beaten that many UFC champions over the course of his career. John Jones truly is one of the greatest martial artists of all time. Skill for skill, one of the best fighters you will ever see, and very loyal when it comes to his team. He has been with Mike Winkle, John, and Greg Jackson since day one. John Jones trying to add to arguably the greatest mixed martial arts legacy the sport has ever seen here and now tonight. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Adesanya is 31. Jones is 33. He weighed in at 205 pounds. He will have a four-inch reach advantage. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Levine. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 20 wins, no losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Israel, the last style bender, Adesanya! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a look-see do fighter, holding a professional record of 26 wins, one loss, and one no contest. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC light heavyweight champion, John Bones Jones! Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to play. You ready? Are you ready? Fight. Round one is upon us between two of the best fighters in this division. Hard to find anything resembling a glaring weakness on either side when you break down the There are no weaknesses in these guys. These guys are as well-rounded as they come. They both can wrestle, both can grapple, both can strike. They can do it all. And these are the matchups that we dream of as MMA fans. Hunt him down. What a punch. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. 
Nice kick landed by the count. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Oh, how about the speed on that reversal there? I mean, I know you can get out of some bad spots, but not with that type of speed. You cannot allow him to get leverage on the bottom. What a sweep. All right, closed guard now. You gotta be careful, though. He's got a lot of submissions off his back. Adesanya is looking to pass here, denied by the opponent. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. All right, so he's got the body locked down here, DC, or so it appears. This is not a guy you want anywhere near your back. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. Israel Adesanya gets up. He is back on the feet. Looked like he was in a submissive state on the ground, but he worked hard there to get back to the feet. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie, really making good use of his reach advantage there with that punch. Oh, beautiful strike there by Israel Adesanya. He's got a lifetime in the game, not a lifetime in the UFC, but you see, this is a lifelong striker who is very dangerous with all legs. Yeah, and when you're standing with Izzy, you're in trouble, man. You're under constant attack the whole time because you never know what he's going to hit you with. And right there, he lands the strike that he was looking for. Adesanya gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for John Jones. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Adesanya. Huge kick to the leg. That oh, big knee. knee. That knee hurt. Oh, big left hook there. Well, he got his head snapped back by that straight hand there, and he's shown a vulnerability tonight by leaning right into that punch as he tries to set up his own offense. May want to focus on some defense here moving forward. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Three minutes have elapsed here in round one. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Look at the force behind that leg kick. Big punch land. Ooh. And they separate. Throwing that jab, no good. Oh, huge block. Jones is circling towards the left side now. Oh, that's a good right hand. Israel Adesanya gets stung by that leg kick. Oh, bleeding from his cheek now. Damage done. Stuff the takedown, no problem. Right hand punch the clinch. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Lands a strike there. Visibly limping here. Jones gets tattooed by that straight punch. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. And he comes through with a big knee. And now he lands a combination. Knee to the body. Nice punch lands. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Final seconds here. Beautiful straight punch there. His boxing fundamentals are just so clean. Oh, he looks so sharp tonight. Round two next. While we look back at some of the replays from that previous round, DC, a lot of good action for fight fans over those five minutes. I mean, high pace, high intensity, all action first round. Both landed multiple strikes. What a great round of fighting. All right, here we go. The start of round two. John Jones versus the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Ooh! 
Those are big strikes. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Right hand upstairs. Real sneaky body kick. Oh, spinning back fist. And a nice job to stick with it there to complete the takedown. Might be a submission attempt here, champ. I mean, you cannot sit in a full guard. When you sit in the full guard, you give these guys so many opportunities. Oh, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do now. He's going to start looking to land big shots from the top. All right, working inside the closed guard now. Well, not ideal to spend this much time on the bottom, but you can't fault him for his activity. Landing strikes here from the bottom. Nice work by Adesanya. All right, north-south position now. We'll see who transitions first. Well, you know, I don't like the gi very much, but I have an appreciation and a healthy one for these types. Ryan, for a submission now. Oh! Why is he not recognizing this right now? He's got to recognize this is dangerous. This is a dangerous position. And this might just be a matter of time. Side control now, DC. When you get side control in a fight, what are you looking at? When I get to the side control in the fight, and I believe this young man should do the same thing, it's secure first. Grab everything in tight. Make sure your elbows are in. Make sure you've got something locked in so your opponent doesn't just squirm away. Punch short punches, but try to make the opponent make a choice. Either he turns back into you, you take your front headlock, or he turns in the opposite direction, you throw your hook in, and you start looking to get a choke off. So 65 total strikes have landed for Israel out of sign. Well, more often than not, DC, when the strike has been thrown, it has found the home. 52% the accuracy rate against John Jones. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Switching stances here. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes him stop throwing. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Such a fast leg. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got to go. Huge red hand! Whoa! Oh, Jones gets hit with a kick. Got the single collar tie. Oh. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Now connects with the right. Oh! Entertaining scrap so far. 
right, let's check out some of the action, DC. And how about the punching acumen by that fighter in that previous round? He does not waste anything. He does not loop punches. Everything's tight. Everything's precise. He's a sniper. We always talk about how he's a sniper. He is a sniper. And it showed in that exchange that allowed him to drop his opponent. Third round underway. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Adesanya gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Oh, nice. Nice. Beautiful leg kick for him. Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Oh, beautiful connection on the feet. He's got it all working tonight, DC. He's in his zone. He's in a zone, and it's going to be very difficult for his opponent to keep up with him. 105 total strikes have now landed for the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. And connecting with 46% accuracy tonight, by the way, against John Jones. Straight punch lands. Just over three minutes to go in round three. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Well, you've got to admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it, lighten up his opponent left and right. He missed with that jab attempt there. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Good takedown defense by Israel. And they separate. Ooh, oh, big knee. Oh, straight right. Oh, nice right hand. And both guys really throwing with authority. That shot blocked by Adesanya. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Adesanya's cut is getting worse here. Man, is that bleeding. Nice straight punch. Going to the leg kick now, and it's there. Nice job by Johnny Bone. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Right punches there. Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. 90 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, a little single collar tie there. Oh, that kick is good by Adesanya. Crippling uppercut for him there. All right, so again, the fighters clinch here. Kind of had an inkling we'd find ourselves back in this situation. Absolutely. Both of these fighters love fighting chest to chest. The uglier the fight, the better. Ooh, what a punch. Under a minute now to go. High-level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Johnny Bone. And he landed the right hand there. 
Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Wow! He's out! He got him! Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 27 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Israel!